Hey there everyone, Ramesh here, back again with another video. In this video, I am going to suggest you 5 Java books to learn Java programming. Well, if you are a beginner and want to learn Java programming, then you can check out these 5 books to learn Java programming effectively. Well, I often receive emails and DMs from you guys like, you know, suggest me the good Java books to learn Java programming, right? So in this video, I am going to suggest five java books that i personally you know refer and when i was a fresher i gone through some books and even i have 10 ex 10 years of experience right now i am also using some java books so i'm going to suggest you you know five books that i personally refer okay without further ado let's get started well the first java book that i would like to suggest is head post java well, if you are a beginner, I mean, if you are absolutely beginner, then go ahead and check out head first Java book to learn Java from the scratch. Well, the main facility of this head first Java book is that it provides a visual diagrams and it provides, you know, a lot of examples to get hands on experience on learning Java programming. Okay. And in this book, you will learn complete introduction to object oriented programming in Java. Okay. The main facility of this Java book is you will learn a lot about object oriented programming in Java. Okay. And you can see a lot of the diagrams. You can see a lot of visuals. You can see puzzles. Okay. You can see a lot of things in this book. Okay. It will encourage you to learn Java, uh, you know, effectively, isn't it? So when I was a fresher, I gone through this book and I have learned a lot of stuff from this book. All right. I'm strongly suggest you guys if you are a beginner and if you want to learn Java programming then just get started with this book okay you will learn a lot about Java from this book well if you ask any experienced Java developer uh, for the book suggestion then they will uh, you know tell you this book only because this book is very famous guys all right so if you are a beginner then go ahead and check out head for Java book to learn Java programming from the scratch all right and this is the link for this book you can purchase this book from the Amazon. I will provide a link, this link in the video description. Well, the second Java book I would like to suggest is Java, a beginner's guide. Well, whenever you purchase this book, make sure that you choose the latest edition of this book. Okay. And this book is I'm going to suggest for absolute beginners who want to learn Java programming from the scratch. All right. And this book is from Oracle. So you can expect all the fundamentals and basics of java uh, in this book okay so we will learn everything about java i mean you will learn the fundamentals basics right so whatever the concepts that required for beginners that you know explained in this book so if you want to learn java from the scratch within examples then you can go ahead and check out this book well this book is quite expensive you can see the cost of this book and if you compare with the head for java book head for java book has a low cost right so I'm going to suggest to choose head for Java book uh, if you are absolutely beginner uh, to the Java so you can go ahead and check out this head for Java. Okay, so this beginner's guide basically teach you everything about Java. I mean the fundamentals basics up to advanced. All right, so you can also check out this book, but it is quite expensive. Uh, if, if you ask me to choose which Java book you can refer between you know head post and uh, complete beginners then i'm going to suggest you to choose head post java well the next book i'm going to suggest you java the complete reference well this book is awesome okay right now i have 10 years of experience in java but sometime i refer this book because this book gives you complete reference to java programming i mean it, it will give you all the apis from all the you know inbuilt class from the java jdk all right, you will learn all the stuff from the Java from this book. For example, you will learn uh, string, you will learn array, string, library APIs, collection, collection framework APIs, multi-threading concurrency APIs. You will learn object-oriented programming. You will learn Swing. You will learn Java Apex. Okay, so all the Java library APIs, uh, you know, very well explained in this book. Okay, and this is complete reference to Java. And this book is huge because it covers all the advanced topics in Java. Okay, especially it covers uh, methods and APIs with an example. So that is awesome for the developers. Well, this book I am going to suggest a Java programmer who already know the fundamentals of Java. Okay, and if you are experienced Java developer, 
then go ahead and check out this book you can refer this book anytime to you know to refer the java apis and get the example from this book and you can reuse in your projects okay and this book covers all the java latest features guys okay and whenever you purchase this book make sure that you will choose the latest edition of this book okay and i am going to suggest this book especially for the experienced java programmers all right and if you are already familiar with uh, java basics and fundamentals also you can go ahead and check out this book you will learn a lot about java from this book all right great well the fourth java book that i am going to suggest you head first design patterns well once you are a good in java then you need to learn uh, design patterns whenever you work on java projects okay so design patterns are very important if you are a java programmer or experienced java developer because whenever you develop the java project you have to use design pattern in order to solve the problems right so go ahead and check out this head first design patterns book in this book you will learn you know the commonly used design patterns uh, with examples with diagrams well this head first design patterns book it don't cover all the design patterns it will cover only the commonly used design pattern so if you want to learn all the design pattern then you can go ahead and check out one more you know in one more uh, design patterns book that is ganga 4 ganga 4 design pattern book okay ganga 4 design patterns book so this book is also awesome in this book you will learn a lot about design patterns okay it will cover all the design patterns guys okay and you can see the rating of this book right so this book is quite famous gang up for design pattern just you can you know browse it and you can read about this book okay so if you want to learn all about design patterns then you can go ahead and check out this gang up for design pattern book and if you want to learn the commonly used design pattern then you can go ahead and check out head for design patterns book all right great well the next java book that i would like to suggest is effective java well effective java book is my one of the favorite java book that i often refer in my day-to-day -day project work because effective java book it will provide the best practices best java practices that we can use in our java projects okay so this book is a very popular if you ask any java experience developer then they will suggest you this book because this book offers you a lot of java best practices that you can use in your project and if you can see the rating of this book 4.7 out of 5 it means that this book is quite popular all right so if you are a beginner or experienced developer it doesn't matter just just go ahead and check out this book and try to purchase this book it will help you to learn java best practices effectively all right and i'm also strongly suggest you if you are an experienced developer then, then you must have to check out this book in order to get all the best practices from this book well the best thing about this book is it will explain all the complex concepts best practices for example you can see the best practices about lambda expressions, functional interfaces, multi-threading and concurrency, collections, all right, and Java 8, 9 features, all right, and it will also explain you the Java libraries and design patterns, okay? So you, you can find all these best practices in this book, all right? And whenever you try to purchase this book, make sure that you will also choose the latest edition of this book, okay? Latest edition basically covers all the latest jdk features all right guys these are the five java books i strongly suggest you to check out because i have, I have personally gone through these five java books and i found them very very useful so you can go ahead and check out these five java books apart from these five java books you can find a lot of other java books out there but these are the five java books i found useful and if you can see a lot of java programmers already using them so you can go ahead and check out these five java books okay Alright guys, thanks for watching this video. I will see you in the next video.